All right, a nice little cut there. Let's go ahead and... I guess we could talk to Liara, but... I think we talked with enough people in the last episode. So let's just go ahead and... Start our mission here. On Wichimacallit land. This is not where we want to go. Exit Normandy, and we're going to take Garrus, I think. Maybe? I really like this combo right here. As much as I like Garrus, like... Hmm... Like, it's kind of redundant. Yeah, we'll go with this squad. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Hello, scanny thing. <laughs> Maybe I should bring other people then? I decided to bring both my lizard boys and they don't like it. But you're fit for combat. That's far enough. We're not here to cause problems. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. You first. We're the law here. Show some respect. I'm Captain Maiko Matsuo, Ilanis Risk Control Services. I'm a Spectre. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, man. We will need to confirm that. Also, I must advise you that firearms are not permitted on Novaria. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. Don't try it. Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock! We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. One, two, three. Captain Matsuo, stand down! We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Parasini-san will meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. You guys are lucky. You would have been dead. Because I have plot armor. I am Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I'm not here to dig out any corporate secrets. That's gratifying to hear. 
Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? An Asari matriarch passed through a few days ago, Lady Benezia. Saren's aide is he. Passed through? Where is she now? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Could you tell me how to get there? You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's office. Commander, it might be wise to bring Dr. Tassoni along. She knows her brother better than any of us. All right, Garrus. He is... What the fuck? <laughs> he is right. Let me go ahead and grab Liara then. If her mother's here, then this is an important mission for her. I do like how the game does kind of do that, though. They're like, um, you know what? This character might be more important to bring with you for this mission. Uh, please be advised. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Alright. We'll probably get rid of um, Rex then, because I do want to bring... Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. I do want to bring Garrus. We haven't used him. Yeah, that should be decent. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Alright, and we should definitely level them up. Especially her. Okay, I think that's generally a good balance. And then we'll go ahead and spruce up. Garrus. Okay, and then what about us? Okay, we don't have any points. Perfectly fine with me. I have to admit, I didn't remember um, how boring Liara's outfit is in this game. Uh, probably because of how boring it is. <laughs> so it is nice that they did change that up in the second and third game. Welcome to Port Hanshan, the well, I guess most third game since for independent scientific research and development. she's only a side character in the second. And to protect the privacy of others, you are required to obey any directions given by our security personnel. Well, we already failed that. Or concerns, our friendly administrative staff is always available. Thank you. And enjoy your stay. Well, thanks to your friendly administrative staff, I have my guns. Which I'm pulling out right now. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Business woman. You know, I wanted to be a businesswoman, but unfortunately, I could not get into business. Hello, Opold. This one offers greetings. You are the specter that visits Port Hanchan. 
Sure, whatever. This is a store, right? Of course. This one apologizes for inconveniencing you. Non-human armors, view standard items, view upgrades, non-human armors. Oh, cool, you can buy non-human armor from him. <laughs> I wish I could actually see what they looked like, though. Though, to be honest, it isn't until the second game that that stuff actually becomes, like, really cool. This game, I honestly, the only cool armor is the N7 and the camo armor. So we're supposed to be speaking with their administrator. This is an elevator. Where is he? Where is your administrator? I have some horrible customer service questions for him. I must be very nagging. business will me and huh well he has to be somewhere right that's the Hanar is he where those Turian guards are at seems like it Oh, this is Gina Pas Par Parasani. Parasini. I, I need to talk to your boss. He's a Solarian. How can I help you? I'd like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas. Yes, what, what? Commander Shepard is asking to see you, sir. Right, fine, come in. What's up, dude? What's up? The gates, man. You will excuse me if I don't stand up. I have no time to entertain refugees from that urban blight called Earth. Urban blight? Wow. I'm here as a specter, not a human. Keep that in mind. Believe me, that is foremost in my mind. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. Businesses come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. I'm conducting an investigation. It's a matter of galactic security. Yes, isn't everything. I will not allow you to harass our clients. This world is private property. I've heard an Asari matriarch is here. Venezia? She arrived a few days ago, accompanied by a personal escort and some cargo. She's up at peak 15. What do you mean, personal escort? The phrase is self-explanatory. Bodyguards attending to the safety of her person, mainly Asari commandos. Commandos? You didn't think that odd? They followed all our regulations. I had no reason to forbid Lady Benezia from taking them. What can you tell me about her cargo? Large, heavy, and sealed. It passed weapon screening. Beyond that, it is not our concern. I'd like to see her, immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the area. Shuttles are grounded and surface access has been cut off. Surface access, you say? Cut off, I said. The roads are not suitable for travel. Don't make an issue of this, Shepard. Forget him, Commander. If he won't help us, I'm sure someone else here will. I have no more questions at this time. Good. I received a dozen urgent messages while you dithered about. <laughs> Mr. Analeas isn't the only one with a pass to leave Hanjam. You've never worked in the corporate world, have you, Commander? You can't bludgeon through bureaucracy. So it would seem. I need an alternative. Talk to Lorik Keen. You should be able to find him at the hotel bar. Can't say more. Not with an earshot of Mr. Analeas. Talk to you later. Very well. Thank you for the info, lady. Alright, let's go ahead and find this 
guy whose name I already forgot. Hotel bar, eh? And where is that? Salarian businessman. Would it be that way? No, that looks like a vehicle exit. And for some reason, I'm still walking towards it. Um, I'm pretty sure it might be somewhere else. Activate elevator. Any unique conversations between the two of you? No, nothing at all. Bar. He's a sales rep for Binary Helix. His name is Raphael Vargas. I need you to speak with him. Do you know who I am? Everyone here knows who you are, Dullstone. That makes you ideal for my job. You are a known quantity, or so Vargas will think. He will assume you are here to investigate his company's dirty laundry. That will distract him from your, my, real intentions. I don't know anything about Binary Helix. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What is your city's interest in Binary Helix? They do not manufacture amps. Much of BH's work relates to biotics. There are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. Powerful ones. Commandos, to be specific. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. You will present yourself as a buyer, on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance. Discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate Binary Helix when he logs onto their intranet. This is illegal. I'll think about it. Let me know what you decide. Sure. Not sure if I want to, but um, here's Lork. Afternoon. Sit down, have a drink. What can I do for you? Are you Lork Keen? I heard you might be able to help me. You are the Spectre that just arrived, are you not? What can an old Turian like me possibly help you with? I'm trying to find a way into the garage. I have places to go. You need a pass. How fortuitous. I'm the manager of the local Synthetic Insights office, for the moment at least. Mr. Analeus closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of rents. I sense a connection there. Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeus' actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. You have a plan? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? Violence against Mr. Analeas' thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. If I have to kill the guards, I'm afraid I can't help you. There's still the law around here. True enough. Though I hasten to point out that Ms. Matsuo disapproves of outside contracting. If you change your mind, I will remain here. I see no other options at present. Okay, let's go ahead and shoot some thugs. That sounds fun. 
Well, there's Raphael Vargas. What up, dude? Okay, he doesn't want to talk to us, I guess. Um, let's take a look at the map. Ah, yes. Pointless room is pointless. Alright then, let me go ahead and go to this guy's office, wherever that may be. My sister's dog just ate a feather. I don't think she realizes it's not food. Anyways, let's go ahead and check some places out. Public extra ain't terminal. Oh. So where the hell is this guy's office? Okay, it's showing us the marker is there. So, I guess we go ahead to this elevator. Yep, I guess so. Unfortunately, these elevators are unskippable. All right. Uh, where's this guy's corporate office? Hmm. I'm still confused. Because it says the objective is here. I don't know. Maybe I need to go back. Perhaps it's next to his thing? Hmm. You know what? We're wasting a lot of time. I think it was back where we were going. Oh wow, 77. Whoa. We are half a shepherd. Oh, hey, those have guns on them. Cool. All right. So this objective is somewhere... He didn't quite say where his office was located, though. Maybe we should go back and ask him. Seems like the only logical option, because I am not finding 
where I need to go, and I'm just running into... Haha, <laughs> the stereotype that people don't like the cold. Alright, we will find this office before I have to cut this video. I hope. That was weird. I felt like we saw Garrus <laughs> right behind us, or at least in the elevator, but also behind us. Okay, dude, you need to tell us where your office actually is, because I have no fucking clue where it is. I feel like I should, but I just don't. Dems the tea. Oh, you know what? The one area we didn't check. Okay, we probably don't need to talk to him. Interesting. Very interesting. Who the fuck are you? Security logs. Unauthorized transmission. Not sure if you will receive this, Doctor, but it is imperative you make your way to the safe location. Your issue with our organization has been leaked. Your base in the Newton system is now no longer secure. I repeat, make your way to the safe location immediately. Ooh. Synthetic insights, blah, 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 disabled. I said beat it. Oh, was that the thing he needed us to take a look at? Because if that really was it, then sort of wow, that was like a wet fart. <laughs> Oh yeah, we already checked this. You hear about the resort, Hello, Lorik. Back again. But what can this old Turian do for you today? I've been thinking over your difficulties with Analeas. Indeed. 
So if I help you, you'll help me. Yes. You need to get into the garage. If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. How did you get a pass? I'm a manager. Most executives on Novaria are free to come and go as they will. You have a plan? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? Violence against Mr. Analeas's thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. I'll focus on trying to get your evidence. If I'm lucky, I won't have to fight anyone. Excellent. Here is my pass into our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD contains an encryption key to access it. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep blood stains off the carpets, would you? What the hell? I thought... What? I thought we agreed to do that earlier. What the fuck? Anyways, okay. I guess it was a good thing we talked to him again. So, we have his passes to go into... The elevator... I think that was actually... I think that's backtracked over here. That's annoying. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and infiltrate this guy's office. 